So we're back here at a Rockland Technologies office and we've got a great chart to go over today. A lot of you ask about the difference between our Alpha Wi-Fi dual band adapters. Now we've shown them to you before on the screen, you've seen what they look like, but take a look at this graphic right here. It's gonna tell you the exact differences between the different products. Some of the things we want to look at are the number of antennas that the product has. So for example, our AWUS036ACH and our AWUS036AC models, they both have two antennas, whereas the AWUS036ACS and the ACHM just have one antenna. So that has to do with how many streams your Wi-Fi connection has. If you just have one antenna, you have one transfer receive stream to your router. That doesn't mean the connection's gonna be slow, but if you're at closer range, and you have your router has two or more antennas, you probably will get better overall throughput speed with a two antenna or more product. And that brings us to the AWUS 1900, which you see up on the chart. That has a total of four antennas, and that product is perfect if you're using it with a router, with an 802.11 AC router that has three or four antennas. You're gonna get up to four total data transfer streams at once, giving you the most throughput. But let's not confuse antennas with range. When we're looking at range, we wanna look over into our power column. Our power column is going to tell us whether or not the product is max power, high power, or standard power. When you're looking at the AWUS036ACH and the AWUS036ACHM, both of those products have our max power. So if you're looking for best range, those are the ways to go. Our other products that have high power would be the AWUS036AC, ACM, and the 1900. Those products are going to get better range than your built-in Wi-Fi card but not quite as high range as our max power products and then we have the AWUS036EAC and the ACS models those are going to be more basic powered models they still get good range but they don't have the high power amplifiers that some of our other models have so I hope that helps you see the difference between these products you can also take a look at the chipset column if you're in uh, if you're a Linux user and you're looking for a specific chipset you can find that right there in our chart and feel free to reach out to us with any questions you might have about these products. We're at rockland.com.